Good morning folks. I just thought I'd make another little video. Uh, you've already seen the Valor number 525R, which is this one. And they call it the Red Ruby because it has a red glass in the inspection window. Uh, and it also came with a beautiful, you can't really see it, but a beautiful copper tank down inside that holds the fuel. And this, I was saying, is a 1914. So she's 103 years old, but working like just beautiful. It took a lot of work to clean it out, clean the tanks, uh, get new wicks, um, just everything. But it, it turned out great. Now, this is a 1915 Perfection model a different brand but virtually identical and this one was made in Canada uh, if I can get in a little bit closer you can see right on the side it says Canada there we are Canada uh, this one uh, was kind of the fancier model it had uh, chrome top chrome trim all around uh, but otherwise identical like I say and it took the same amount of work uh, the bottoms I got the chrome up pretty good when I go around over here to the top you can see the the top isn't bad but it was pretty pretty damaged from 40 years 50 years sitting in a barn uh, I got them both out of Calgary from two different people and I want to thank my daughter who had just given birth to our new grandchild uh, Peyton Grace and I had her running around like a yo-yo could you pick this could you pick that could you meet these guys she was absolutely awesome so thank you uh, Katie and Peyton <laughs> who went along for the ride anyway uh, that's it I'm just letting them burn try and get rid of some of the uh, excess paint uh, some I had to repaint parts others I didn't want to touch because it was still shiny still original uh, I never changed one bolt to a new one in either either of these units everything I did was absolutely original so it's pretty cool you know you got to think a okay, hundred and hundred and three years later and just solid as a rock these old girls I just thought it'd be cool to try it play around and uh, anyway there you go bye bye